You're the prospector. After driving four hours from Los Angeles, we are here at Death Valley National Park. We're off. We were up around 4,000 feet a little while ago. We're at sea level right here. Tomorrow, we'll be at the Badwater Basin. That's 282 feet below sea level. That's the lowest spot in North America. Savage summer sun. Death Valley has the highest recorded temperature on the Earth. 134 degrees Fahrenheit. This is our first lunch stop. Anthony, you're working at some tuna? Very. Uh, sugar. On the dessert already. Yeah, but uh, tuna for the main course, it looks like. Craig, what'd you have in that uh, tortilla shell? Tuna? <coughs> tuna. <laughs> tuna. <laughs> tuna around the horn. Cheese. Well, tuna for Jack, too, as well. <laughs> tuna around the horn. All right, we're doing a little off roading right now. Yeah. Heading off to Mosaic Canyon for a good four mile hike. Oh, we almost, we almost ran off the road there, buddy. 1240, peak heat of the day. Perfect time for a nice hike in Death Valley. The biggest dune is that star dune right out in the middle. Yeah. Uh, if you walk out that way to the top, it's about a 45 minute hike oh. or so. Yeah. Well, is that all? There and then 45 minutes back though, right? 45 minutes one way. Oh, one way, yeah. Mm -hmm. I should be able to do that. Oh, guys. Another, another taste of awesomeness. Are you going to come? I'm just going to... Aussiness or awesomeness? Aussiness. Awesomeness. Oh, awesome. Oh. Awesome Aussie. The Same thing. What's the difference? I'm going to go across the Razorback, up to the top. <laughs> the Razorback? Wow. The Razorback. In Arkansas? Nice job. What was the time? 27 minutes. 27 minutes, that's impressive. 27 minutes there and back. And the average person takes 45 minutes just to get there. So what's it like when you get out there? Good. There's uh, no footprints like here. There's just no one out there. <laughs> It's a brisky point right now. Climbing up probably a very ill-advised trail. Jack, you're not too keen on this idea, are you? No, I don't like it that much. This is pretty steep, loose rocks. Got a camera in one hand. Oh, it just dropped straight off over there. 
isn't a trail. This is just a level spot that's about three inches wide. And that's how far those guys got. Close to the sunset. Beautiful up here. Oh man, I'm a lot of breath. Looks like that trail anthem keeps going. Craig, you can make it all the way up. Look. If I hadn't done anything else, I'll do it, but I don't think I'll survive. All right, we got some pretty rocky ground here at the campsite, so we're gonna set up our tents on the blacktop pad right here. That was a good idea, Anthony. Thanks. Want a lot of space between you snoring people and me, okay? You're at the far end, Barry. I don't know if this camera's picking him up, but he's back in the woods over there. He's way back there. That's where all the rattlesnakes hang out, Jack. That's right. That's a sweet light you got there, man. Hey, thanks, yeah, Brandon. Appreciate the investments you're making That's for the camping right. trip. Gonna, oh, avocado? Uh, <laughs> avocado? Tomatoes. Tomatoes, yeah. Cheese. Tomatoes. Oh. And, um, tomato, cheese, and uh, tuna. We got this table lit up like Times Square, right don't we? How much right. light is on this thing? Right. Barry, you got nothing but a banana in front of you. <laughs> oh, I've got tuna. Yes, oh, there you go. Peanut butter. Peanut butter. Oh, you're a man of known heart, Barry. Sugar free. There dessert. you go. How's that hot water coming along, Marsango? All right, get your uh, soup cups out, gentlemen. You ever try sea monkeys in yours? Uh, sea monkeys, no. Yeah, they got a nice flavor to them. We each had our own shopping cart, freedom of the whole supermarket. Everybody walked away with the exact same thing going. You remember one of my little shells? I got these little shells right here. I got this whole pack. Look at this pack. 98 cents for this whole thing. Anybody want a little shell? You guys all got the big ones. Anybody need a little one? Nobody wants anything that I'm offering right now? <laughs> Nobody? Jack, what in the world are you making here? You got some of your pecans over here. And some uh, peanut butter. Peanut fish? Crunchy oh. peanut butter. There with the banana. And then we got the mocha cafe pudding. Is there a name, a special name for that, Jack? It's a burrito. It's a... It's easy for you to say. Oh, it's terrible. How is it? <laughs> 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 it's delicious. It is really good. Whoa. Mm. Yeah. Good. You want to bite, Anthony? <laughs> <laughs> you hope I make yeah, you one tomorrow. Good. good, Jack. It Taste. is really good. Toast it. That's really good. This is so good, I might start making this at home. <laughs> uh, this is the Borax Museum. Howdy, sir. How are you? You are the real deal, aren't you? Pretty close. You're the prospector. Doing some work here. I'm uh, making arrowheads. The fellow named Borax Smith, who, who had a, a knack of finding playas with salt deposits. Essentially, 1870s, they discovered these deposits down here. Mm. All the white stuff you see out on the flats and, and oozing out of the hills is borax salt. Built the Harmony Borax Works, came up with. Uh, uh, the idea, he actually designed the, the 20 mule team wagons because they'll carry 35 tons of borax. I mean, they had to run them 350 miles to Mojave, which was where the railroad was. And I still use 20 mule team borax for laundry and a Boraxo for hand cleaning. Fascinating. I wish we had room in the minivan. I like to, <laughs> like to bring it. What's your name, sir? Joe. Joe, pleasure to meet you. We're on the Golden Canyon Trail. You guys ready for a big hike here? Yes, sir. Yeah. Got a mouthful of sunflower seeds. Anthony, you all seeded up? I'm ready. Let's go. All right. <laughs>
Look up in the rocks to your left. See the sign up there? Uh, why? Sea level. Wow. Look at that. We're underwater, guys. We're in Madwater Basin. This is the lowest spot in North America, 282 feet below sea level. Try to take the van off road here, you get about three wow. feet. That's right. You'd be done. Well, the terrain definitely changes. Wow, it does. Look at that. Wow. That's good. Yeah, I can see what it is. Yeah. Yeah. Sweet thing, Jack. We've got these titanium faces, craft light shafts, custom reps. Is this windy at the campsite? At the campsite? Sure hope not. You know why? Oh man. Those tents are gone. Oh no. I don't think it will be. I think it's covered. We'll be fine. Oh, oh no, look at this. Oh, this isn't good. Is look at our tents. tents. Are they ruined? Are they like ripped? That wind is really ripped up. Someone put rocks on them. What do you make of this, Craig? This ain't good. That's they bent? Oh, one right through your tent, buddy. Any problem, Randy? Being bent like that. Oh, let's see that, Barry. Oh, man. Wow. This is dramas. Our plan is we're going to put our tent back where it was, and we're going to put rocks on it. And then we're going to keep it where it needs to be until we get back from the pool and dinner. And then we're going to take the rocks off, set it back up again. And then get our body weight inside, you know? We'll get our body weight inside and that should be enough to keep the tent down. Down at sea level, actually 282 feet below sea level in the bad water basin. We are now at 5,000 feet at Dante's Point. It is freezing up here. We just arrived. I'm gonna go in the car, grab my coat, maybe some long pants. But the view, as you can see, is gorgeous. That's the bad water basin right down there. Sweet or what? That was amazing. Praise God. <laughs> what a way to cap things off. What do you think, Marcengo? Praise the Lord, man. Praise the Lord. Impressive, huh? Oh. You tell me there's no God after seeing that.
What are you doing, man? You're reading, what? You're reading systematic theology? That mattress will keep you nice and comfortable all night long. This is. You're sleeping there, barely even fits on it. No, it's perfect. Oh, that's beautiful. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That looks really comfortable. Oh, boy. You got that mummy sleeping bag, too. That air mattress of yours. You're going to fly. You're going to fly away like Aladdin on that thing. Although Anthony, I did I did see a picture of a uh, tarantula at one of these visitor center things. You even have a pillow there? Yeah, I got a camping pillow, sweatshirt. It's getting hot. I'll let you guys go to sleep. Yeah, please, we're, we keep waking us up. <laughs> yeah, we gotta get some body weight inside that tent. I was over there giving the guys a hard time, and I came back, and the tent was blue wet. You brushing your teeth and everything? You know what? This might be my first time in like years where I've never brushed my teeth before I went to bed. I'm just, I'm so tired. All right, what we got going here is, it looks like Jack and Anthony are sleeping outside underneath the stars, no tent. Barry's tent survived. Our tent collapsed. The other guy's tent collapsed. But we've reassembled our tent, right? Yeah. So we're, we're alive again. But this side, you can tell. You can see this? It's like so strong a wind, it's blowing the whole side on top of me. That wind is strong. It's going to be really cold because it got cold last night. You might see some lights over there. You know what that is? That's the bathroom. We're actually not even on our campsite property right now. But we're in the trees. We're in the trees and hopefully we'll get a little more shelter over here. Anything else, Craig, for tonight you want to say? I think we'll sleep well. We'll sleep well. We're tired. We've had an awesome day. A lot of walks. We'll be fine. All right. Praise God that this was all here still. What happened was someone saw that our tents were in trouble and just before they completely blew away, which they would have, they'd be up in like oh. Northern California right now somewhere. Uh, someone threw a bunch of rock, collapsed them and then threw rocks on them all. So they were all underneath heavy rocks. So there's like a good Samaritan out there. We gotta find out who the good Samaritan That's so is. Nice. And they'd left. They'd left and they left. saying thank you. AmericasParks.us. That'll take you right uh, to my uh, channel, and uh, then you can. America Parks. Uh,